If you're trying to update Windows and you get a sign that says fix issues, that says that there are problems and then it tells you that Windows needs more space, this means you don't have 10 gigabytes free on your hard drive to be able to update Windows. So it needs to have you put in an external hard drive of some kind. A USB drive works. I tried this with an SD card and it didn't work. So you want to use a USB thumb drive. It doesn't matter if there's other stuff on that thumb drive as long as it has 10 gigabytes free and it's just going to be temporary for Windows to use to store temporary files while it's updating your operating system. Now if this happens then you want to try using a different external storage media. I tried using an SD card and I got this error. I tried it three times and it kept failing. If you say cancel here, it'll go back to the way it was. So you go back to the pre-update state. So if that happens, take out whatever uh, external storage device you're using and switch it out for a USB drive with at least 10 gigabytes free. And then if everything went well, it's going to ask you to restart and it will install Windows just fine. And Windows will show you some of this stuff for a while, and then after that, you're going to be fine. So now, if you look at your C drive, you can see you still have a lot of free space on there. So the new update didn't really take a lot of space. It just needed to expand and collapse. And there are some files on the external drive, but you don't need them. So you can unplug the external drive, the USB drive, and take it off now.